see y'all. I'm in Dollar Tree. Dollar General, rather, not Dollar Tree. Trying to get me some snacks for the movies I'm about to go and see. I don't know what to get. I had picked this up. But chocolate might melt, right? It's so hot out, y'all. I don't know. This is a movie snack. Raisinets. Raisinets. Butterfingers. How many of y'all buy y'all snacks before the movie theater? <laughs> or is that ghetto? I've never actually done it before. This is my first time. Tappy. I don't know. That might be enough candy, y'all. I need to get this light to the store. I need to get this light to the store. I need to get this light to the store. I don't know what number this is, but we're switching the boss versus number one. Y'all, that was definitely a good movie, but I got a headache. It be so loud in the theaters, y'all. Why they gotta play it so loud? Oh man, I got a headache. So we saw Mission Impossible. Um, not really my choice, but I went anyway, and there's definitely going to be a part two to that one, because that was part one. Um, that movie was two hours and 45 minutes long, y'all. Um, action from beginning to end, if you like those kind of movies. I'm more or less going for comedies, but um, I'm interested to see what happens with part two. Now it's time to go get something to eat. Yeah. Which is retarded because yeah, you know, my first name is Alisa. <laughs> and I still forget. But you know what's funny? You know, like maybe growing up, you had the people you were always around yeah. that your parents knew, but you don't know their names. But you've known them for a I like the color. Matches my fingernails. Hey, y'all. Um, Happy Sunday. It's a couple of days after the movie theater, y'all. And I was like, I never finished closing out that video. When I tell you I have had a week, I have had a week. I have had a week. And 
is like, I want to talk about so bad everything that took place over this week. But I just can't until later when I tell y'all I was so angry. Oh my God, angry is not the word. Angry is not the word, y'all. But I'll make sure and tell y'all in a story time one day after the fact. But anyway, it's Sunday, y'all. It's a couple of days after the movie um, and after the nail salon. It's, I said that already. I said it's Sunday already. I'm tired, y'all. I'm cooking turkey burgers today and some sweet potato fries. That's mine to go to when I want to do something easy. What are y'all cooking today? I don't know. Sundays aren't just Sundays anymore. You know, we used to get in the kitchen on Sundays and cook big meals and stuff like that. I don't know. It's like nobody really eats what I cook anyway. Like, um, my son always does his own thing. You know, my husband, he'll normally eat what I cook, but it's like, since I don't really cook with too much like salt and stuff like that, I feel like nobody really <laughs> wants to eat it. <laughs> so I don't know. I'm, I'm trying to like find some more seasonings than just like the basic stuff that doesn't have like sodium and stuff in it. So I found this Tony Saturays, the no salt tony saturates but that's about all i found um i wanted to get tap of the browns seasoning i don't think that has sodium in it but um haven't been able to find that in the store so i don't know if i have to order that from amazon or something like that and i wanted the seasoning that um one of my friends on TikTok makes, um, she also has a YouTube channel too, Still City Mukbang. Uh, she's the lemon pepper crack lady. <laughs> so I have to order some of that. Um, she says she has one with no sodium too. So I don't know, like, I don't know. Like I know who watches my videos, but I don't really know like I guess the demographics of it all. So I don't know like how old a lot of subscribers and stuff are, you know, if they're older or younger, a mixture. I know for people more or less who would be my age, maybe y'all like are into more into like watching um, or have to watch, I should say, like the things that you're eating and stuff like that. So if any of you know, like of any other kind of seasonings I can add to food, please let me know. Because so far it's just the basics, you know, onion powder, garlic powder, black pepper, Paprika, which I don't even know if that's really like, you know, for flavor. I think that's more or less for color, unless you're using smoked paprika. Um, like I said, I found the Tony's, but I don't really know, you know, too much of what to use. So let me know what some of y'all have come across, if y'all have come across that. Y'all, the movie was good. It was really good. Like I said, it was action-packed from beginning to end. It's not usually something that I would pick to go see, but I wanted to get out the house, so I'm glad that I saw it. But, you know, when they do the coming attractions, so um, they have a new, what's the name of it? I want to say, I think it's Expendables. 
Expendables coming out with uh, Sylvester Stallone, Woody Harrelson, I think. And again, not my typical movie like that I would watch. Let me try to remember what I was saying <laughs> before my storage ran out, y'all. Oh, I'm sick of this. Y'all, I got that camera over there. I still have not learned how to work that camera. And it's like, I'll be up here talking and not even realizing that it stopped recording. But what I think I was saying, the only action movies that I've really been into, um, what is the guy's name? Something Nielsen, I think. He playing like the Taken movies, stuff like that. Um, I like those, like him. You know, those movies, I usually don't go for action unless it's like somebody big in there that I like, like maybe Denzel Washington, stuff like that. And even then, like I very rarely go to the movies to see it. Like I just wait to see it at home or something like that. But the movie was really good. Um, the, the upcoming movies, I think I was talking about. They have one with Sylvester, Sylvester Stallone and Woody Harrelson. Is that how you say it, Harrelson? The Expendables and 50 Cent is in there. I love me some 50 Cent. So I will be going to see that. Um, then Denzel Washington has a new Equalizer coming out. So I want to go see that. And then they are making a movie on Bob Marley. So I want to go see that. They have him and his wife. So I want to see like if they get into all the messiness that was their marriage. I think her name is Rita. This camera keeps cutting off, y'all. So I'm going to stop here. Thank y'all for stopping by. At least I'm doing it my way. Make sure you follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok.